We work in the plant model system, Arabidopsis, um, and specifically we're researching red light signaling. So plants sense different wavelengths of light and they adjust their behavior and development accordingly. Basically we look at aberrations, mutations in the plant's DNA and see how it changes their response to uh, red light. Agriculturally, there's some applications. So you can imagine if you have a row of corn and they grow really tall, that plant, the corn plant, is putting in a lot of energy and nutrients from the soil and sunlight into growing the stalk. But what we are really interested in is the corn cob. And if we could alter the plant's growth so that it doesn't grow as tall, but it can still grow nice big cobs of corn for us to eat, we wouldn't have to give it as much nutrients. We could plant them closer together and wouldn't have to give them as much water. Getting undergraduate research experience has guided me in my path. So it's not just getting the, you know, something to put on your resume, but it really tells you what you might be interested in doing for a career. So working alongside with the professors, um, you get to, I mean, you get first-hand knowledge of how to think, how to run the experiments and work the equipment. It, it really just adds so much to your education because you can really learn to, to think at the level of a scientist and um, to think critically and logically.